Hey, what's up, y'all? And today we're playing Into Samamore. So this game caught my eye because it just looked cool. You know what I'm saying? Let's go ahead and start it up. I think this is a demo. I forgot. Between these two choices, which animal spirit do you think you have? Probably a chicken or I'm a dinosaur. Well, neither one of them. What the fuck? What kind of damn... What the hell? You know what? For the hell of it, I'm going to say I'm a chicken. I'm going to say I'm a chicken. Like, what kind of... What, 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 what that mean? You know what I'm saying? What that mean? What that mean for me? Spirit animal, chicken or dinosaur, come this way, Henry. The mayor has been away for a few days. This is our chance to break into his house. Why y'all trying to break into the mayor's house? What the hell kind of shit is that? There must be a reason why one person disappears from the town every year. Maybe, you know, vacation? What the f Hmm, things are scattered everywhere. It doesn't look very normal. See, this will happen when kids spend too much time in the house they start thinking life ain't real you feel me what are we finding the list of names of the 19 missing victims after the first three cases the mayor hid their names only by knowing who they can who they are can we identify the similarities help me find that list phone directory well the game look good a newspaper page about an airplane accident the airplane with the flight number Buku 29 caught fire and crashed into the Samamore residential area, killing 94 people. Damn. The strange thing is that all people on the plane disappeared, including the crew and 59 passengers. This event happened 21 years ago. That's kind of weird. Before we keep going, I want to turn down that ambiance, which I appreciate. You know, they got they got sound effects for damn near everything. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to go ahead and turn that down a little bit because it's way too goddamn loud. Way too damn loud. Yeah, a list of households in the town. All right. A note from the mayor. I saw that thing fall into the forest at the same time the plane was crashing. It was burning, emitting a strange purple light. Then year after year, I had to witness children gradually disappearing. Their parents didn't seem to care. That's because everybody aliens. Never thought about that? Watch out for it. There's something very strange about them. I only have Stephen left, and he is at the same age as the missing children. I fear one day he'll disappear too. The enigma of the disappearances persists. After the plane crash tragedy every year, one child disappears. The only person to return is Elroy Porter, a male college student who used to live with a friend his age. Elroy refused to share any information with anyone, muttering, I don't know who to trust, not even myself. Subsequently, it was believed that Elroy vacated the town. The meaning behind his words, however, remains an enigma. You like that word enigma, huh? Eat an apple helps you recover one heart. Uh, yeah. Hell yeah, blood. Strange occurrences reported by the town's residents in Diana was chased by a winged worm while passing through Samoa Forest. Elroy Porter frantically warns everyone not to trust their relatives. Kimmy sees tendrils writhing in the drain of the sink. Linda hears screams from the forest. And man, this sounds like some shit out of it. You know what I'm saying? Little Anna says that her mother's getting fatter and fatter. Sometimes a few eggs fall out of her body. Yeah, this sounds like some shit out of it. All the kids disappearing. You got some kids that's going to band together and try to find out what's up. There's no tattered book compared to the others. You can see a piece of paper tucked inside it. Henry, come here. I found something. Me too. I found a list. I know why the mayor isn't here. Look at this. A map. Steven is still alive. He begged for my help in my dream. He said he's in a very dark place in the forest. I have to find him. There's also a word, temple, written in bold. My gut tells me this might be where we'll find our answers. It's located in the town's forest. Is anyone there? Help us. I don't know about that. Save us. It's one o'clock in the morning. Well, look, don't act like you don't act like it's weird because y'all broke into somebody's house at one o'clock in the morning. Please save my boyfriend. He's just been stabbed. Let us in. He's out there hunting us. I don't believe that. I think your ass might be, you know, it's like vampires. You invite them in, that's when they can come in. What happened? Tabino and I were attacked by a man while crossing the forest. So you must be tourists. The locals know not to go near it. After being hunted by that madman, I get the reason now. That's not what I meant, but you can thank that for your own peace of mind. How'd you escape? No, we haven't escaped. He's still hunting us. Then you're out of luck. The adults here, they won't care about us. We can't leave him like this. Do you see that house with the lights on? There's a 50% chance there's a first aid kit. Wait, a 50% chance? And a 50% chance the killer will spot you when you step out. 
I mean, I guess them statistics. I, hey, look, it's a chance you might find some shit. Just like it's a chance you might find a, a apple, a random apple, sitting on the table. I'm gonna, I'm going for it. Keep an eye on Tabino for me. There's a 50% chance you'll find a med kit. She's bold. Are you scared? Nah. This is nothing compared to the plane crash 21 years ago. You should have seen the photos of that carnage. My parents, their bodies were split in half. Apart from that, man, panicking, panicking or being afraid will lead to bad decisions. Stay calm. Mm-hmm. You're awake. Emma's going out to find bandages and antiseptic for you. You can't trust her. What do you mean? She's a skinwalker. There's a madman chasing us, but she's the one who stabbed me. Oh, damn. You got stabbed by your own girl? Watch out for it. Why would she do that? I don't know, but whatever it is, don't leave me alone with her. I told you, skinwalker. So what we do? What we do, dog? Everyone's telling a different story, but they all agree there's some madman chasing them. He's bound to find his place eventually. It's just a matter of time. I'm gonna check the kitchen for weapons. I think getting out of here is a better choice. We found a list anyway. You don't want to help him? If you're fine dying for strangers, go ahead. But if that's your choice, you're on your own. I'm gonna look for weapons. Yeah, but just know I hate it when you always choose to sacrifice yourself for others. Yeah, but at least I'm living for a cause. Your punk ass trying to run. Yeah, you little scary bitch. Yeah, I said it. And you can save a statue of a woman holding a sword. When saving the game, you'll recover health. So it's like Dark Souls. Oh, shit. They giving me a bow? Hell, yeah. Destroy everything from afar. This is the most difficult weapon to master. Yeah, but I'm Steph. You know what I'm saying? I'm me, dog. I'm me, dog. I'm me. New DNA. Ugh, DNA. What kind of DNA? Customize your weapon with creature DNA, making your weapon strong in various ways. I'm liking it. Open the menu to view inventory. Shit. What's that? You don't feel confident enough to learn another weapon. Maybe next time, you think. All right. Well, let's go ahead and look at my DNA. Didn't I pick up some DNA? Yeah, what's my DNA? Ability 15. Oh, it's on? I guess. I don't know what that means. You don't feel confident? Oh. So what, what the jar would have been? Throwing jars? Hey, I got grenades. I got jars. Jar grenades. Oh, you found a weapon already? Hope you know how to use that thing. That's what she said. Are you sure you don't want to help him? Yeah, I'm sure. Even if I cared about him, I wouldn't have the energy for it. Why? Because I know I'll be the 20th vic victim, Henry. That's why I came here looking for answers. How can you tell? The past few nights, I've seen the adults in town watching me through my window. Something weird is going on. They want me, Henry. Maybe the adults are the ones who kidnapped the previous 19 people. I'll protect you. I know you like to imagine yourself as a hero, but I don't want you in danger. Well, I mean, I am the one that went to look for a weapon, so what'd that tell you? Uh-oh. Emma's back. Hope she found the first aid kit. Let her in here. No, I don't think so. That ain't look like her. It is inside me. No, it's more than inside you. It's inside you and outside you. Oh, shit. She's drinking his fluids. That That's a parasite. I've seen a lot of them in the forest. Tell Jack to escape. Henry, come hide with me. There's no need to die saving him. Tell Jack you'll kill Emma. Uh, you can tell him yourself. Why are you always so stubborn? Here, take this apple. But I already have one. Don't you dare die on me here. All right, then. Ugh. I fucking hate this damn. Now, look, they did say... They did say... Ugh. This shit kinda... This kinda random. Oh, what the fuck? The way she moves so retarded. Oh, I got you, bitch. I see why it's hard to master. I see exactly why this shit hard to master. Oh my god, I'm about to die. Let's use the other one in. I think I can beat her. Yeah, I think I can beat her. Is she transforming? Oh shit, she transformed. Fuck. Oh, 
Oh, I'm about to die, my nigga. I gotta be careful. I think I got this. I mean, it ain't hard, but it's like... I learned. Me learn. Yeah, I like the little dodge system they got. That's cool. Whoa, I almost died. I got, I got a little. I won on my last heart. I, I see what they mean by the the bow being. Each weapon has different techniques that you can unlock. Yeah, I can see why they say the bow kind of hard to master because it's a real. It take a while to shoot. And it's, it's, it's real stagnant, you know what I'm saying? It ain't like a sword where you can get up on some shit. But I like using bows in games. I, I'd rather a bow. You feel me? Henry, have you finished imagining? Are you okay? Son is standing there. He often daydreams like that. Yeah, and I won. So, I think I predicted the future. I turned it up the house upside down but couldn't find a first aid kit or any bandages. I don't know what to do anymore. Tabino is all I have left. You notice Jack's staring intently at emma you're curious about what jack might be thinking she might be a parasite yeah stay in there until morning if you go out again that maniac can find you too even quicker part of me wants you both to leave but i can't say it because i really need someone with me right now i know you're in there he found us faster than i thought i'll give you three minutes to step out of there so those two kids won't be involved make jack's making that face again Henry, hide in the kitchen. Just stay there and listen to what's going on. Don't do anything rash. I'm starting to think there might be more to this than what these two are telling us. But what if I want to stay here and kick some ass? All right, let's save. Go ahead, save. Hey, who are you? What are you doing? What are you doing out there? You can't let them escape. I'm the one who will kill both of them. Are you the crazy man? I could be many things, depending on the story those two tell you. If you want to hear my side of the story, then to me, those two are the real crazies. Why do you want to kill them? Because they took away the last thing I cherished. My life is empty now, but before I face it, I must take their lives. I must make them scream in pain with my own hands. What do you want me to do? Don't tell anyone you talk to me and just watch when I take action because I can see you're holding a weapon. I know you have more questions, but I only answer two of them. Once I've answered those two questions, I'll be inside this house. Well, I did. Oh, ask when that happened. Ask the person who was killed. Ask why that person was killed. See, the way they word quit these little statements is kind of retarded. Sometimes they talk third person, sometimes first person. Or maybe it's second person. I don't know. But they need to word, like, talk like I'm the character. You know what I'm saying? Talk from my perspective. Like, ask the questions. You feel me? Like, what happened? Who was killed? Why did you kill them? You know what I'm saying? Ask why you didn't call the police. Ask why that person was killed. Because I don't even know what the hell to ask. Why you didn't call the police? Because I want to hear their screams, their pleas for forgiveness. When a loved one is killed, you should have the full right to decide what you'll do with the murders. But if you hand them over to the police, you know you won't know what will happen. You'll no longer be the one in control of the situation. Sometimes with a good lawyer, they might not receive what they deserve. That's when that happened. And then when I when I ask a question, they need to disappear. As the person who was killed. What was killed? That's my mother. I came home and found a body on the floor. Two questions have been asked, and now I will kill those murderers. See you behind the door, kid. Well, this is a bunch of bullshit. Didn't I get a... I got a technique point, right? They coming in. Technique. See... God... That's retarded, man. See... You need to tell me what I'm buying. I had, at the last second, I just saw the sword and the bow up top. Tell me what the fuck I'm buying. Like, explain. It's just saying technique two and technique one and shit. It's like, I just wasted my damn point. And see, at that point, you need to let me pick another weapon if I'm just gonna sit. Man, that was retarded. That pissed me off. Jack, hey, look, the killer coming in here. I asked him two questions. He said, after him two questions, he was coming in. He's looking at you with a calm expression. You know he's letting you decide how to handle the situation. He's in. Why are you chasing us? I know what you did yesterday morning. You're crazy. I never seen you. I never even seen you before. 
Oh, but I saw you stab my mother multiple times and then put on that white dress. What are you talking about? You're confusing us with someone else. We didn't kill anyone. Henry, whatever you're gonna do, now's the time. Kid, you don't believe me? I don't know what the hell I believe. Henry, you... You killed him. The murder is no more. What will you do now? I'll take Tabino to the city hospital. The stab wound isn't too deep, but it can't be left untreated. You did what you had to do. Don't feel guilty. We owe you our lives. Look, from my perspective, I see somebody trying to kill two other people, one on the ground, dying. Like, come on, man. I don't know what the hell is going on. He tell me one thing. They tell me another. I'm like, you know, old boy did say don't trust the girl. She stabbed him. So I don't know. It's finally over. This might sound crazy, but that murderer looked familiar. I think I saw him here when I was a kid. I'm not sure. I don't know if killing him was the right choice, but in that situation, you chose to protect them. Let's hope none of us regret it. Wait a minute. Give me the list of the 19 missing people, Henry. Just by looking at it, I'll immediately recognize the similarities between them. Thank you. With this, the answer will be revealed soon. H Henry. Listen carefully. No matter what happens, you must not come looking for me. Don't come looking for me. You can't leave me here with this pile of guts. Something terrible is about to happen. I can feel it. Worse than Jack actually becoming the 20th victim not long after. Could it be that he figured it all, all out in that moment? But why did he tell me not to look for him? Why didn't he share anything with me? I have to find Jack. I want to tell him everything. Uh, investigate what happened to Jack's room. The victim who disappeared a year ago has been found lying outside the forest. He's a reporter, university student. The boy wouldn't say a word, but he gave the police a piece of paper with a picture of a black door drawn on it. Doctors are actively working to restore Aroy's health. Hopefully, he'll be stable through the recount what happened to him. A newspaper? Another resident of Sam Moore Town has disappeared. What is happening? Will with this curse end? Why do the townspeople still live there instead of leaving? Warning the tourists don't go through Sam Moore Town. Jack's bed, you feel strange seeing someone in a panic taking the time to make that bed. Uh, glass from the window is scattered out inside. You wonder if something crashed in from the outside. In a sense, yeah, there ain't nothing else to look at. Danger, keep out. Well, I'm going in. You can't tell me what to do. Oh, it's your pup. What's your pup? You said Husky with an engraving on his fur. Henry, you don't know if that means his name is the same as yours or if someone sent it to you. Whatever the case, you decide to let the dog join your team. I got a dog, dog. Thanks for playing. Hey, you know what? I'm fine with that being a 20-minute demo. That was actually pretty cool. I liked it. I hate your little, your little technique system. I think it's retarded. You need to explain things a bit more. Do you want to restart the demo with the techniques and items you currently have? Nah, because I ain't going to be able to use the shit. You know what I'm saying? Unless I pick the sword, but I don't want to pick the sword. Hope y'all had a good time watching me play into, into Sam Amore. It was pretty cool. I liked it. You know what I'm saying? I think, look, I like the art style. You know what it is for me, though? I like the art style. The The combat pretty dope. And they did say, when I read up on it, they said on the page that this game was challenging. You know what I'm saying? That it was going to have some tough boss fights. So I was I was mentally prepared for that fight to be tough, but I ain't know what to expect. You know, like she constantly moving around. It ain't nothing to learn. You know how I like to sometimes, not all the time, but I like to go into some of these games with boss fights, and I like to kind of be passive before I start attacking. Learn how the, the enemy work. Do they do they just straight up start attacking you? Do they play the defense game? Do they stay back? Are they real passive? You got to know that stuff. Because sometimes when I don't give a shit, I'll just run in there and start attacking. But when you're using the bow in this game, you got to be real careful because you, you, you stagnant. You know what I'm saying? You can't go nowhere when you shoot. You know, as you shoot, you stay still. So that's enough time for the monster to attack you. And she was so random, you ain't know where she was going to go. I mean, the, the main thing to watch out for was them damn red spikes that come out the ground. I mean, yeah, when she touch you, she hurt you. But mainly the red spikes is what hurt you. I think one of my least favorite things about this game is the, the dialogue. It's too much dialogue. Too much shit going on. Too much reading. You know what I'm saying? I get it. It's lore and it's story. But if I was playing the full game of this, I wouldn't read all that shit. You know what I'm saying? All them notes and stuff you find on the ground. And then interacting with notes ain't work. Y'all notice how when I was in the kitchen trying to talk to that whoever that was, that redhead, I was trying to talk to him. 
and I was standing like right by the sink. But the dialogue, the text box or the text bubble over his head popped up. And as I'm pressing A, it ain't work. So I had to go by the sword. But the problem with going by the sword to interact with him, the, the, the bubble over the sword was popping up. So I'm like, I ain't want to interact with the sword trying to talk to him. So they need to find a way to make interacting with, you know, text or collectibles or, you know, characters. They need to find a better way to make that not only more responsive, but don't have so many things bunched up together. And, and most importantly, the main thing for me, you need to find a way to like explain, I get it, this is a demo, but explain your damn techniques. Like I ain't, I ain't see them little symbols up top. You know what I'm saying? Cause they was the same color as the background. They was brown, I think. It's like, have them different colors. You know, have the sword like a concrete color, gray. Have the bow maybe like a greenish color or some shit. And then the potion thing, maybe have it white. I don't know. Or orange or some shit. Like, make them stand out. Because I wasn't even paying attention to them. I'm just reading the text at the bottom. I see where I could spend my technique points. So I look and I see the, the, the text at the bottom. And it just say technique one, technique two. I see technique one and I just press A on it. Come to find out, that's the technique for the sword. That's kind of retarded. You know what I'm saying? That pissed me off. Because I wasn't able, even though it ain't make sense at that point, it ain't make sense to give out the technique. I get it. You want people to just kind of get familiar with the system. But why give us a technique point if you ain't going to let us use our technique? You should have had some other fight in this game. You should have had another fight. But then again, I guess that's where it come in where, you know, if you want to, you know, you can start over the demo and try out your techniques. You know what I'm saying? But, I mean, who really want to go back and play the demo again? Well, I mean, I can't speak for other people, but I wouldn't do that. One time is enough. You feel me? But, yeah, that's it. Hope y'all had a good time watching it. I like it. They just got to fix some things. You know what I'm saying? But that's it. Hope y'all had a good time. If y'all want to check the demo out, I'll drop a link for it. Let me know what y'all thought about it. And thanks for watching.